Greetings, people! Numbaro here, and today we're going to be playing some more Bounty of One, as we've got a brand new character added to the game, Nakoto, or Nak Natoko. Oh, I pronounced that wrong. Natoko? Okay. Never actually heard that name, but whatever. <laughs> I like it how they actually, like, added him into this. Like, this is going to look really cool. Every time we get a new character, they're just added into the scene. I like that. So, either way, gets bonus movement speed, and his attack speed is faster the closer he is to an enemy, but slower if he's farther away. We're just going to play on Infamy 1, just to start this off. Just to get a little feeling of how the guy works, and then we'll, you know, we'll go from there. Alright, so he does attack by throwing projectiles. Oh, his movement speed does feel very fast. Oh, my, move, my attack speed goes up from 0.6. Alright, this guy's really weird to play. Alrighty. Interesting. Uh, fine, we'll take the epic area because honestly, I think a dash build would be something we're going to want to go for. Though attack speed focuses would be nice too. Wow, like this movement speed feels amazing to start with. May as well grab some crit damage if we can get the one ability that makes it so we get the instant crits off after a dash. That would be really nice. Yeah, this is not a character you want to start standing. To tell you that for sure. Like, right away. Just run up to dudes and just... Probably should have picked that rare attack speed, all things considered, but... Oops. Pop, 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 pop. This is such a weird weapon. Oh, wait, how fast can we burst this guy down? Ah, uh, not as fast as I would have liked. That was weird. He just wasn't attacking it for a second. Uh, oof, I don't really want any of these. We're going to hit the reroll. Because he got the one reroll. Yeah, let's go for the slow. Let's see what my attack speed. Like, I get up to, like, five per second there every once in a while. Man, what's this guy going to look like if you get the, what is it, the little friend, the big boost to your, damage, your attack speed at, at the cost of damage, but, cause what is it, three times, no, five? No, it's five times attack speed, I think, at the cost of, like, three times damage, or, I don't know. I don't use it that often, it's a legendary, it doesn't show up the m most often, but, right, some attack. I don't know why I forgot that one. Okay, well this is an this is interesting. This is actually a very different move set. Do I want to take the crit chance? No, I want to wait. I want I want to get that one upgrade. I really hope we can get it. Wow. All right. Yeah. No. This guy's good. Onion. No, we're gonna go for some dash stuff. I just ran an onion build. I'm not sure. I probably won't post that video yet. I, it was during the stream that I did, and uh, yeah, so it'll probably this will be probably posted first. But there, there was an onion build I did recently where I got it as my first item. So I'm gonna do another one right this right now. All right, so let's boom. Yeah, I don't have. I need the ninja headband to really get dashed up going. There's some really good dash hits. Ooh, that was close. Oh man. Mm, fine, we'll take the legendary damage. I think that that's a little bit more important right now. I would have loved to have got the area, but I don't really have any of the dash stuff yet. And there's no guarantee I'm going to get it, so I might kind of mess myself up by trying to force a dash build. But, like, you can always get them. There's so, there's so many common items. So I'm just probably not going to get them this time because I want them. More movement speed. Let's go. Ah. Too close. So that, that's the risk of this guy. I can tell you that already. I think everyone could have guessed that, though.
I don't want that. That's like the one dash thing I don't want. Grab the pierce stuff. Oof. That actually should give me the ability to hit some things from farther away because it doesn't really affect my attack speed if I'm up close. It just even though I then get more attacks out. I don't think that was worded in a way that made sense, but whatever. Man, once I could eventually get that crit chance, of some, or what's that? The ability to get the guaranteed crits, this is gonna be some damage, but I'm already hitting pretty good. Oh, I guess I should mention how to unlock this guy. Yeah, this guy's really easy to unlock. All you have to do is just beat a game with Nigel. If you have already done that, you'll have to do it again, but it doesn't matter what difficulty, I don't think. I just did it on Infamy 1, and it worked. So. Though, the game straight up tells you how to do it. Like, when you go to the character select, it's like, those are what you gotta do to get them. So, there's no mystery to it, but, you know, I just thought I'd mention it. I wish Elites would spawn in a little faster. I want more items. <laughs> we at 130 damage. Not quite enough. Wow, I one shot at that guy. That's an interesting weapon. I like it. There we go, we got another elite. Burst him down. Mm -hmm. Damage. Oh wow, he uh he didn't go down as fast as I would have liked. Hmm. How's this gonna work with the other thing? Honestly, it's probably better than the uh piercing anyway, so if I get the bounce first and then the pierces, that's actually probably, yeah, it seems to be how it's working. So that's, that's beneficial. Alright. Not about the best thing, it's not really what I wanted. I probably should grab more attack speed, what am I doing? We gotta get this attack speed up to really crazy levels. Even though the damage is pretty good right now. Crits are beautiful when they happen, but they are infrequent at, you know, 5% crit chance. I'm just really hoping for a very specific item. Interesting. There you go, ninja headband though. Maybe should have took the no. I could have took the other thing. Oh well. Oh my god, this is actually pretty funny. Ah, damn it. Oops, I thought I had more dashes than I do. That's my bad, completely. Oh, bad. This would suck if I died. Wow. I'm doing horrible now. Alright, you know what? Let's grab 10, up to 10% crit chance. Gotta really get these crit damages to go. Like, I can't guarantee that I'm gonna get that one upgrade that I really wanted. I only had the one reroll, and I already used it. So... Something like this, and I will take the take the bomb. Don't love the bomb, but we'll take it. Probably one of the least exciting dash items, but it does still give you an extra dash charge. So kind of just you're doing dash build. You grab all of them. 
Let me... Man, that attack speed is like... Watching his attack speed just fluctuate like it does is crazy. Ah, damn it. Grab that. Yeah, definitely need cooldown reduction now. I have, my damage is pretty good, especially because my, you know, my attack speed is silly. Because they've been causing the projectiles to bounce out all over the place, but we're. Ooh, man, it's a hit for over a thousand there. Ah, damn it, I didn't see that coming. I just love how these projectiles just come back every once in a while and it's like, nope, we're gonna take out one more guy. Oh, I'm 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 watching you guys. You can't hit me with no Well, anything. Fireballs is what I'm trying to say. So next patch we should be getting, I'm not sure if it's a just a new boss? Or we actually get a full... Or we're going to get some new enemy types. It'll be either or. Or maybe both. We don't know. Part of me is hoping it's more still for just an enemy type. But I think that, like, that's one of the reasons I like this game so much. Is that it actually is one of the only like Arena Survival Roguelites that actually understands the importance of enemy variety. Like If you want to just have enemies walk at you, there needs to be more to it than that. Because like... You know, you got stuff like Vampire Survivors, which has minimal enemy variety as well, but it succeeds due to essentially creating like these like puzzle-esque moments of how you dodge this certain point that occurs at this certain time on each map. And very few of the games even try to do that. So I don't know, I appreciate the variety of enemies, because they're all different, they all have their own purpose. Here, grab a little bit more quick chance. I built up so much crit damage, I need to actually get some value out of it. Got a lot of dudes with that bomb there. That was actually pretty good. Alright. This is going to be interesting. Bop, 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 bop. burst these guys down pretty fast the little summons if i can get some crits like you can watch the health bar just diminish come on Alright, I, I need more crit chance. As soon as, if I can get some crit chance going, this essentially becomes a super legit build. You have 50% more damage in your dash and ability cool is never reduced by 30% when you have 50%. Alright, well, we'll take that. Also because I didn't really feel like doing a gluttony build again. I, I like Gluttony, but I just want to want to just run it. I like running different items. In. But I could purposely try to drop my health a little to get into this range just to see how well this works, but I don't really feel like it. It'll happen eventually. Pop, 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 pop. Man, I thought that was another enemy projectile. There's just mines still bouncing around there. Wow, really just all commons right now. Oh, crap, good chance, I guess. 20%, so it should be one in every five, statistically, is about it. Accurate. 
I, I know that's not exactly how percents work, but that's... There's a bit of randomization to it, but on average, it should be every one, one every five. Wow, this guy's actually got a bit of health to him, huh? Nothing dashy? Nothing dashy. I'll take the guidance system, why not? working well. I, I'm liking the character. He's adding a new way to play the game, which is always nice. That's what you will kind of want from a new character. Because there wasn't really a huge... Like, there's a bunch of different builds that this guy will really benefit from. Like, dash build for sure is the obvious one. But, like, you could do stuff like with Onion with him. He'd actually be very good with it because you want enemies in the range. There's the little friend. Do I take it? <laughs> I had an attack speed of 40! I didn't expect to actually get this. I don't know if it's really that good, but it sure is funny. If we can get the attack speed up to like 40 shots per second, that's so... That is nonsense. You have to be close still to do it. It's actually going to probably really weaken my dash stuff. Alright, so we're at the half health point. We're still hitting for, what, 85 on a regular hit? That's actually not bad. For the fact that we uh, dropped it by three for times. Grab the slow down the enemies, the projectiles. Really just allow people to just... They can't approach me. All right, we got... Lost all the extra bonus damage, so... 57 is my base hits now. Yeah, that's actually quite a bit. That's a, that's a big benefit, actually, from using that. Oh, yeah, this slowing dude is ridiculous. All right. I know I don't really shouldn't be just grabbing crit damage over things, but that was a big crit damage increaser. I don't think we attack so fast. We get some, we get some value out of it. I think it's I'm at thirty percent now, which isn't actually that bad. It's not amazing by any means, but it's not bad. I don't know how many more deputies we get. So I didn't actually get the build I wanted, but I ended up getting something silly. So, <laughs> wow, ow. Yeah, my dash power has been severely weakened. Alright, let's go up to 40% attack speed. Or not attack speed, uh, damage. Attack speed, I don't even know what that percentage from the base is. So I also don't really know what my starting attack speed really is. 
the fact that a crit still one shots things with this attack speed is actually pretty impressive. This build went work. This build went worked. This build had done went worked. If you know what I means, and I know as you knows what I means, because I know what I means, and if I know as you knows, and you know what I mean when I'm talking about what you knows what I mean. Yeah, you knows. Ah, oh, damn you and your explosives. I was gonna stand there and. Well, stand there, I guess. There was really. There wasn't an and. Alright, let's see how well we can take this guy down. Let's just grab the damage. Or maybe attack speed would have been actually probably. No, attack speed would have been the most beneficial. Oh, we got him in a single cycle. So not bad. So, like always, if you'd like to try this build, here's the code. It would be pretty fun to try. Is honestly, just knowing what you're getting later on. Build for it, and you could probably do something silly. And I have no idea why it keeps doing that. It's been doing that since the patch, but whatever. Either way... I hope you enjoyed the video, and I hope to see you guys again next time. Bye for now.